Okay, today is day two of bikini prep competition training. Um, I did arms today. Uh, diet was the same. I didn't have any problem with any of the food that I prepped. Everything tastes fine, so I have no problem eating it. Um, plus, I only have to eat it for a short period of time, so that doesn't really bother me. I went to the gym on my lunch break. Um, my goal actually was to get up at 4.30 and then get to the gym by 5 and be done by 6. That didn't happen. As you can see, it's really dark and stormy. You can see all that out there. Um, it's really dark and stormy where I live and it has been like that all day. So I'm making an excuse as to why it was so easy for me to stay in bed this morning. Um, but my goal during prep will be um, to get up at 5 or to get up at 4.30 and be to the gym by 5. Especially as we move into the actual like prep part when I'm having to add in cardio. Because right now I don't have to do any cardio because um, we're just working on muscle building. So as I start needing to add cardio in, I will need to be able to work out twice a day. And it's going to be imperative that I get up at 4.30 and get to the gym by five. Today's workout um, was solo at the gym by myself. And I don't feel like I pushed myself as much as I probably should have or could have. Um, I don't know why I am that way when I work out alone. I don't push myself as hard. Um, I think that's probably pretty universal, but it is what it is. So today's workout was uh, wide grip lat pull downs. I started with 70 pounds, went 70, 75, 85, 85, and then dropped back down, a uh, drop set to 70. I have it written down, so hold on as I reflect on my notes. Um, and then it was single arm bicep cable curls. I did that, uh, for 20, 15, 15 were my weights, and then I drop set it down to 10. Um, and then tricep cable pull downs 25 pounds, 30 pounds, 35 pounds, 35 pounds, and drop set to 20 pounds. Uh, machine assisted pull ups, I did 10, 8, 5, and 4. Um, then we went to oh, the close grip seated cable rows. Um, I only did three sets of that at 50 pounds, 60 pounds, 60 pounds. I got really tired towards the end of my workout and that was actually the last thing I did. I just wrote it in, I didn't write it in order. Um, I had barbell bicep curls and then I supersetted those with some tricep uh, skull crushers. 30 pounds for all those. I did 15, 14, 12 for my reps. Um, and then I did single um, arm bent over rows and that was six at 35. So that's kind of where I'm at right now. Um, yeah, I listened to this lady and she talks about manifesting and I'm a big like believer in the universe. Um, and so one of the things that she was talking about manifesting is like, if you want something, you have to create this visualization in your mind and something, and not just in your mind, you have to create this visual thing, right? A visual experience. And so she recommends like, taking a picture of yourself and putting it into that situation that you want to manifest and talks about how it creates this emotional connection in your brain um, to the outcome. And it, it it rewires your brain to make that outcome come true, which I didn't, I do believe in manifesting. I do believe in all that kind of stuff. Maybe not to the degree that some people do, but I think that those things are real. Um, but today I thought I would try it because I've been trying to like visualize and meditate on me winning this bikini competition, which I know sounds dumb at literally like three days. So two days into the actual prep, three days into food. Um, but I don't know how else to like make that those things happen for my brain. Um, and so I, I did like create a visual experience of me on like my head on the body of a bikini com competitor um and I it was weird because that like emotional connection is like a really real true thing like immediately I was like oh my god that's me like I'm standing on the stage and I won and I took first place and all the things so anyway I thought that was interesting thought I would share because I do think those things like I said they're interesting so um 
but yeah, that's my update for today. It's nothing really super exciting. Tomorrow I have another day of legs planned. Um, meals should again be the same. I shouldn't see anything. It'll be interesting to see how this weekend goes because I do have a birthday party on Friday for one of my husband's friends and then Saturday we have a concert. So I will keep you guys updated on how diet goes for that. But all right, let me know if you have any questions.